Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about the definition of absolute value intervals. Now, absolute value intervals definition is kind of a somewhat of a circular definition in that it's intervals defined for absolute value. Now, it really depends on what kind of absolute value scenario that you have to work with. Now, if you have a situation where you're just graphing an absolute value, then the absolute value generally, depending on what it is, can be from negative infinity to infinity. Now, if you're solving an absolute value inequality, for example, that's where it's going to change. So, for example, if you have an absolute value of x, let's just say less than uh, 2, then again, absolute value being a distance, you want to be sure that you want to find the values of x whose distance is going to be less than 2. And what from algebra, this can be split apart rewritten as x is between negative 2 and 2. Now, as an interval, you want to think about this as negative 2, 2, and because the numbers are non-inclusive, because there's no equal sign, that's where the parentheses comes in. So that's an example of an absolute value interval. Now, if you have a situation where the absolute value of x is less than or equal to 2, where equality is possible, what this allows you to do is write it this way negative 2 less than or equal to x less than or equal to positive 2, where you have negative 2 and 2, but you would surround it by brackets. So depending on what the situation is, the intervals defined for the absolute value depends on what kind of exercise that you have to work with. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's the definition of absolute value intervals.